Hey YouTube, Vivi here. Welcome to another episode of Mass Effect Legendary Edition. We are right smack dab in the middle of a side mission. Um, if you recall, it's regarding the compounds that are on the Earth's moon. Um, they're the alliances, but the VI um, has taken over the base and there are three different compounds. We've done two of them and we are inside the third base and have to take care of the AI or VI or whatever. <laughs> so let's jump on in, shall we? Okay, here we are. We are inside the third compound. We are ready to go here. Uh, looks like we've got something here. I'm just gonna use some Omni gel for now for this mission. I know you guys are probably yelling at me. I'm sorry But we've got Okay, so they're all literally right there. So let's do some Barrier stuff Um, actually let's do the shield on him and he can do barrier Okay Um, we need to do overload and you need to warp him and I need to do something else. oh god still still well maybe we should just hide and then shoot around the corner wait what way to start the freaking video BB Get over here. Thank you. And you over here. Thank you. Yeah. Good boys. <laughs> he already threw his barrier. Okay. Okay. I'm freaking out a little bit. Um, so I don't think that works on them. I have to revive. Okay. Wow. All clear. That was tough. <laughs> Jesus. Can I save now? Thank you. Okay. Mm, I don't see any bad guys. I don't think I need to do that, but I'm just doing it, guys. <laughs> I'm just doing it, because... We have to blow the other ones up. Why not blow these up? Okay. I don't think there's any bad guys in here. I don't see red marks. I don't seem to be poisoned at the moment. I think it's over. Additional security drones powering up. Okay. Um. We just gonna leave them there for a second. Okay. All right. Bring it on. <laughs> A 
Oh yeah, Rex. Okay. Again, you guys need to stand out of the way of terribleness. Over here, dude. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Do I have any? I still have some bombs. Good. Okay. Um, this one. Here you go. This one. There you go. Okay. Is that it? Medigel deployed. Ooh, I almost died. Okay. Oh god. I'm not using my handgun like you guys told me I'm supposed to be because I don't have my sh shotgun okay burst of white noise over all frequencies nearly def deafens you your hair heart suits heads up Display inter <laughs> interprets it into a series of zeros and ones. They repeat again and again, blanketing all frequencies until the lights on the final VI cluster flicker and die. Specialization class achieved. Your specialization class will replace your base class in the talents on the squad screen. Talent ranks in your base class transfers over to your specialization class. Go to your squad screen to view the bonuses you gain with each rank in your specialization class. Cool. Shock Trooper. All right. Um, shock Troopers, highly trained killing machines. <laughs> shock Troopers excel in all combat situations. Increased health, increased damage protection, Improves the immunity of barrier abilities and improves the adrenaline ability. Cool. All right, we. Dead and done. That's the way I like them. <laughs> I love Rex. Dead and done. All right. Cool. We have a specialized class now, um, and I was told to put points. I want points. Okay. I have so much to do. I want to wear. Okay. I'm going to do assault training first because I want to wear medium armor. It's driving me nuts. So we're doing it. We're putting all our points here for now. Um, Caden. Caden, you should be in electronics. Please, sir. Thank you. And Rex, let's do some health for you. So since you're going to be my tank, that's a good idea. Should probably finish up this stuff too, huh? And give him some more stasis. So much to do. So much to do. Okay. Um, let's leave. Oh, um, I will be recording two episodes today, uh, so if you have any tips or tricks that you're going to be giving me, um, it won't be implemented until, um, so this is 14, so 16, I will have read all of your comments and talked to you guys about it um, and stuff, so don't get irritated with me <laughs> if I don't do something that you tell me to do. Um, but I have heard you. I know now, I realize now, I know that several of you have probably said this to me, but I only, I'm, my Vanguard is best with hand guns and pistols. I've been using the assault rifle. Um, 
and that's wrong. So <laughs> I will try really hard to remember that I need to make the people use the guns that they specialize in. I will do that. Okay, enough of my little rant. Let's figure out, let's do our um, next main mission. Um, which is, uh, we have a couple different things we could do here. Um, Noveria is obviously where Benezia is. Um, that's cool, but I was thinking about Vermeer. You've reached, you've received word that a Salarian recognizance team on Vermeer has information about Saren. The message was unclear and the council fears the team is in danger. So I would like to do that first and then we can probably go to Noveria. Um, if we have time in this episode, if not, we'll do it in the next one. So let's go to Vermeer. Um, since it's a main mission, I'm assuming it'll be flagged for me to easily access um, on the space map. <laughs> the galaxy map, excuse me. All right, let's pop out to the main one here. Yes, okay, cool, it's clear over here. Um, is there only one place to go? Looks like... Yep. I just want to make sure I'm going to the right place. <clears throat> okay, there, Mir. Here we are. Should we... I'm going to real quick see if I can survey any of these planets. We'll be right back. Okay, no surveying for me. <laughs> Not in the Hawk system, whatever. Okay, Vermeer is a lush frontier world. Ooh, we haven't been to a lush planet yet. Um, ideal for colonization by carbon-based species. Its vast seas and orbital position on the inner life zone has created a wide equatorial band of humid tropical terrain. Unfortunately, the political instability of the nearby terminus systems has impeded colonization efforts. The high risk of raids by pirates and slavers makes it an unappealing homestead. Okay, let's go. Okay. Ooh, this music though. Sorry. All right. All right, so we're taking Rex, because he's my pal, man. He's my pal. Um, and let's go with Caden again. I'm, I'm liking this this trio with, with Caden and, and Rex. I don't know if that's a good idea or what the ideal... Actually, if you guys know, what would be a vanguard like myself? What would my ideal two um, sidekicks be? Let me know in the comments if you know or if you suggest something I would really appreciate it. Thanks. Commander, I'm reading a signal. Must be our Solarian. Oh, Check good. Those defense towers. Drop defense. the Mako. We'll go in hot and take them out. Look at this Get place. Underneath their radar, Commander. This place is cool. Oh, damn. Got a clean drop, Commander. Stay out of range and continue evasive maneuvers until I bring those AA towers down. I know the drill. Meet you at the camp once those towers are offline. Joke around. Hmm. All right. All right, so I have towers to get down, apparently. There's a gatehouse. So there's a straight stretch. Um, so... Are the towers at the gatehouses, I'm assuming? Oh, that's the AA tower right there. All right, I'm just going to flag it. Okay, so let's just get rolling. We're already facing the right direction, so that's perfect. Oh, there's bad guys, though. Bye. 
there's... Okay. There's a ton of them somewhere. Are they up above, maybe? Oh, okay! you go oh he's gone already easy there beep easy there baby this part's kind of oh, okay I keep hitting shift instead of control to zoom in my pinky's not working today guys okay so there's getting meta gels that's good all right i'm sorry i'm going really slow through here guys these are at least really cool i just don't want to get like ambushed you come from? Where are you? <laughs> That's not gonna work. Okay. So far our shields are hanging in there. and I'm killing them. <laughs> Lovely. I don't see some. Oh, I'm jammed. Uh-oh. dudes I've been killing this whole time. Alright, this is not gonna work. Oop! shield. Come on, 
Give, 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 give. need to go this way. Okay. I wonder if anything um, special is that way. was sighting me. I didn't see him. That is a big ass gun. Oops, I bushed button. Oh. Well, which, what do I shoot? The big gun? Or do I go in? Are you dead? You better be. Um, so I'm assuming I go in? Oh god. do shit. Okay. Alright, let's try this one instead of using all my mini gel. Oops, that was... Okay. Oh, I should have gone there. Woo! Okay. I'm reading that the grid is down, Commander. On approach to the Solarian base now. now. Nice. Cool Ready beans. to move out, Commander. Wait. There's nothing else I can do? There's...
Okay. Whoop! Sorry! Ooh. Okay, there's... That was the Normandy! Oh god. Damn it! There was a dude right here. Got him! That zoom is fairly decent, man. I think we can, um... to see if I've got any better guns and stuff. Okay, there's still bad guys. Whoop! Is the Solarian's camp? Oh. Clear the hell over here. Okay. Commander, Normandy's touched down at the base, but it looks like we're grounded. The Solarian captain can explain when we get here. Okay. Here we are. So what are we supposed to do now? Stay put until we can come up with a plan. Are you in charge here? What's the situation? I'm Captain Kirahi, 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG. You and your crew have just landed in the middle of a hot zone. Every AA gun within 10 miles has been alerted to your presence. What are we supposed to do in the meantime? We stay put until the Council sends the reinforcements we requested. We are the reinforcements. <laughs> what? You're all they sent? I told the Council to send a fleet. We couldn't understand your transmission. They sent me to investigate. That is a repetition of our task. I lost half my men investigating this place. So what have you found? Saren's base of operations. He set up a research facility here, but it's crawling with Geth and very well fortified. Is he here? Have you seen him? No, but his Geth are everywhere and we've intercepted some comms referring to Saren. This is his facility, there's no doubt about that. What's Saren researching? He's using okay. the facility to breed an army of Krogan. How is that possible? Apparently, Saren has discovered a cure for the genophage. What's so important about curing this genophage? It was the solution to the Krogan problem. 
We introduced the Genophage to the Krogan population after the uprising, to quell their numbers. Without it, the Krogan will quickly overrun the galaxy. And these Krogan follow Saren. Rex is not going to like this if we stop it. <sighs> well, I mean, stop Saren, yes, but no. Oh. Geth are bad enough, but a Krogan army. He'd be almost unstoppable. Exactly my thoughts. We must ensure that this facility and its secrets are destroyed. Destroyed? I don't think so. Our people are dying. This cure can save them. If that cure leaves this planet, the Krogan will become unstoppable. We can't make the same mistake again. Oh. We are not a mistake. Oh, Rex. Is he going to be a problem? We already have enough angry Krogan to deal with. Uh. He'll be fine. I'll talk to him. I'd appreciate that, Commander. My men and I need to rethink our plan of attack. Can you give us some time? Go ahead, Captain. I'll come back soon. We won't be long, Commander. In the meantime, if you need any supplies, you can talk to Commander Rentola. He's in one of the tents nearby. Okay. Looks like things are a bit of a mess. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't be so worried if it wasn't for Rex. Looks like he's gonna blow a gasket. Well, wouldn't you? Ashley? I mean... You think I should go talk to him? Yes. It wouldn't hurt. Well, it might, actually. <laughs> Just do it carefully. I'll be careful, but be ready, just in case. I'm always ready. Oh. Oh, I feel bad. Poor Rex. Oh, he's just shooting shit. <laughs> okay. This isn't right, Shepard. If there's a cure for the genophage, we can't destroy it. I understand you're upset, but we both know Saren's the enemy here. He's the one you should be angry with. Really? Saren created a cure for my people. You want to destroy it. Help me out here, Shepard. The lines between friend and foe are getting a little blurry from where uh, I stand. Oh, crap. This isn't a cure, it's a weapon. And if Saren is allowed to use it, you won't be around to reap the benefits. None of us will. That's a chance we should be willing to take. This is the fate of my entire people we're talking about. If you can't give me a better reason than this to destroy the hopes of my people, then I'm done with you. I can't let you jeopardize the mission. So that's it. All this time and that's all I get from you. How can you not see what this means to the Krogan? This base can't be destroyed. I won't allow it. These Krogan are slaves of Saren. Puppets, tools to be used and discarded. Is that what you want for your people? Oh, I got charismatic achievement. No, we were tools for the Council once. Oh. Thanks for wiping out the Rachni. They neutered us all. I doubt Saren will be as generous. Shepard, you've made your point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. Just one thing. When we find Saren, I want his head. That's fine. You can have his head, Rex. Woo! Man almighty! Okay. So... Talk to the soldier? Surprised that Krogan yielded to your argument. Okay. Mm, what does Garrus have to say? Normally, I wouldn't think much of Solarians in a firefight, but these soldiers seem well trained. Okay. Hi, Tally. The upcoming battle frightens me, but I know Saren must be stopped. Greetings, human. I am Commander Rentola. I can provide you with supplies for the upcoming mission. For anything else, I suggest you speak with Captain Kirahi. 
Um, let me see what you have. What little there is. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, that's... Yeah. Do you have... Decryption still low? What? Are, it's at max. Cadence dis decryption is maxed. What? Nice work with Rex. I didn't think anything would calm him down. It won't be an easy fight, but we're ready when you are. Okay, mm. I was just seeing if um, F would let me <laughs> get back in the Normandy. I don't think we have a choice. We have, wait, this seems like last battle shit. I'm not ready. The can't, this can't be, this cannot be. Your ability to calm the Krogan is impressive. I'm surprised you were able to reason with a Krogan. Skill too low. Hmm. Okay. Thank you for speaking with the Krogan. The assault on Saren's base will be difficult enough as it is. I assume that means you've come up with a plan. Of sorts. We can convert our ship's drive system into a 20 kiloton ordnance. Crude, but effective. Nice. Drop that nuke from orbit, and Saren can kiss his Turian ass goodbye. <laughs> Unfortunately, the facility is too well fortified for that. We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Where do we take the nuke, and how do we get there? The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. It does sound a bit risky. Is there no other way? No, but I think we can work around that. I'm going to divide my men into three teams and hit the front of the facility. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. Shadow team, do you know that BB can't do stealth? There's a problem. I need an adult. It's a good idea, but your people are going to get slaughtered. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive. Lord. And that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me. To help coordinate the teams. Oh, so pick one that's going to die. Man. Good idea? No. Ah. Uh. Oh, man. You expect me to commit one of my people to your command? We are all soldiers by trade. If your people are not prepared to face such a risk, would you really want them by your side? He's right, Commander. We can't do this without both teams at their best. I volunteer. No! Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. I'll go with the Salarians. With all due respect, Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. Why is it that whenever someone says, with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? <laughs> Take Ashley. Williams, you'll accompany the captain. No heroics, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I will have the ordinance loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, Commander? Uh, yeah. The Normandy's picking me up. How will your teams escape the blast? We will engage the Geth as long as possible. Once the bomb is in place, we will fall back to try and escape the blast radius. If we move quickly, we should be able to escape with acceptable casualties. If acceptable not, then our casualties? will live on as martyrs to a greater cause. You talk like this is a suicide mission. Lord, it is. Sounds like. I won't lie to you, Commander. There is a chance none of us will survive this assault, even your team. But we do what is necessary. Shadow seems clear enough. What would the other teams be called? Eigor, Manavai, and Jeeto. They were the initial settlements on our first three colony worlds. They are at the heart of Salarian territory to this day. These names will remind my men what they are fighting for. They must have a personal stake in the fight if we are to have any chance of success. That makes sense. Give me a quick rundown of the plan again. You are Team Shadow. We will create a distraction while you infiltrate the base. Make your way to the breeding grounds at the heart of the facility. 
Disable the AA guns so the Normandy can land and deliver the nuke. If we get that far, we'll try to help you with guns, but don't count on it. Once you have the bomb, place it next to the geothermal taps. Then get out before it detonates. I want to know more about the bomb. How reliable is it going to be? Its reliability depends on the person arming it, but it will do the job. The drive system is highly impervious to damage from external sources. Once it has been armed, very little can stop it. The key is getting it into place and armed before the Geth can stop us. I'm ready when you are, Captain. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. Well, this is it. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone, LT. You too, Commander. We'll be fine. You'll see. Yeah, I just... Good luck. Is there something you want to say, Chief? I, I don't know. It's just weird. Going under someone else's command. I've got used to working with you. All of you. Aww. Don't worry. We'll see you on the other side. I know. I... It's been an honor serving with you, Commander. Let's kick ass. <laughs> it doesn't matter if we're not in the same unit. We are still a team. Watch each other's backs, keep your eyes open, and fight like I know you can. We'll all come out of this in one piece. You bet, Commander. You all know the mission and what is at stake. I have come to trust each of you with my life. But I have also heard murmurs of discontent. I share your concerns. We are trained for espionage. We would be legends, but the records are sealed. Glorying in battle is not our way. Think of our heroes. The silent step who defeated a nation with a single shot. Or the ever alert who kept armies at bay with hidden rats. These giants do not seem to give us solace here, but they are not all that we are. Before the network, there was the fleet. Before diplomacy, there were soldiers. Our influence stopped the Rachni, but before that, we held the line. Our influence stopped the Krogan, but before that, we held the line. Our influence Thanks. will stop Staren. In the battle today, we will hold the line. Good luck, Commander. I hope we will meet again. Oh shit. <sighs> so, what if, what are all our everybody should be coming with me, right? <laughs> oh my god, this is so bad. I feel like I've totally skipped a whole section of the story. But I can't go back. I've totally screwed up, but I didn't know. Like, how are you supposed to know? It doesn't tell you in any way that this is the final mission or whatever. Maybe it's not. Maybe I'm just talking out of my ass. I have no idea. I've never played this before. Com check. Do you read me, Commander? It's fine. Let's move. Good. We'll start our push. We'll try to make it to the AA guns, but it might be up to you to finish the job. And Commander, if you see any way to undermine their defenses, we could definitely use the help. Okay. Taking out communications. Shadow is on the Repeat, shadow is on the Son of a bitch. Okay. Coordinated crossfire. Check for long range turrets helping the Geth target. That's too far. I'm just kind of taking out there the snipers. Um... Okay, I've got to use a sniper. I can't.
Why am I not using my powers? God dang it, it's not just a gunfight. Okay, well. Screw it, I'm not. Okay. Something scrambled, they're targeting. We've got a shot. Yes. Chief William. Let's take the heat off Manavai. Who are you shooting at? Oh. Well, just come this way, guys. Oh, shit. Did it die? Sure. Okay. I just tried to reload. Oh god. I think somebody's stuck in the wall. Which is fine with me. Yeah, totally stuck in the wall. You guys, come on. Give up on that one. Put some of the stuff on my <laughs> my bar. Um, who are you freaking shooting at? Satellite uplink disrupted. Oh God. Okay, Caden. All right.
Access to base security. Woo! Should be able to cut the alarms from here. Might even be able to trigger alarms on the far side of the base. It'll clear the guards out for us, but they might be too much for Williams and the Solarian state. Just disable the alarms. We can handle any guards inside. What happened? What? Why did it open and then shut? There's a lot of guards in here. Can I save? Oh, yes. Oh. So there's a dude here. some pre uh, things I gotta do. So, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!